Peace, I'm Open Mike Eagle. Dumbfounded. Psychosis from the Thirsty Fish. Project Blow. We're on Freestyle 101 on G4 TV. We're about to go choke out a microphone in that room over there, so we'll see you in a little bit. <laughs> come on, come uh, on. Oh, yeah. Thirsty Fish. Project Blow. Thirsty, Thirsty Fish. I like underground. Come on, why? Okay. Yeah. It goes psychosis, mind focus. You don't want it with the live locust. With open to the right of me, another tight MC. And that's DFD to the left of me, the next MC to wreck the beat, to rip the beat viciously, or rapidly. Rats will be chewing your flesh at rapid speeds. Cats don't want to tap R rapidly to rapidly, blast your fleet. Blast Come your fleet. Fleet. Battle toll, get in your vacuoles, put you in Zelda catacombs. Lacking it when I'm attacking the flow. Open, watching G4 since attack of the show. Or Leo the tech guy, I always get fly to the next day when I watch my interview on X Play. Electric, watch how eclectic they sound. Battle me, giving me A plus ratings on Electric Yo, Playground. On X Play, like Tony Hawk on X Games. Most of these MCs need a sex change. Maybe I'ma smash them with my pectoids. Attack them like Metroid. They get up over like this was sex toy. Yes, boy, so you better listen to I'm ripping crews cause they pitiful I'm the principal while they in middle school They get ridiculed And I, and I, and I knock them off their pedestals Like a pedestal, but pitiful They're minuscule, I'm dissing you And I'm also dissing whoever's next to you Or adjacent to, I'll erase your crew Then I'll come back and erase you I'll erase the eraser too So you can't redraw yourself You better redraw yourself Like X-Play or Attack of the Show Or Replay when we play MD when we play MDK, Mortal Kombat, spread wings like Wombat, but species is way beyond that. Uh, I tap on any MC like I was tap shoes. MCs wanna rap, but nobody wants to rap with you. I don't like your attitude, so I battle you over a cup of apple juice and use aphorisms to battle midgets for raffle tickets. It has to be me. MC would never be blow, but I also come back when I represent without no cheat. Yo, codes. it's a me from the super body, your brother, and you can't believe it like this was Fabio's butter, and I'm an audio lover. I'm working things out. Burning the cardio blubber. So what, sir? You wanna battle me? You can't count the strikes and counter strike that I've attacked with half life. Not smoking on crack pipes, cause that's life. And that's how we rip it though. Thirsty uh, fish, we work in this. Yo, can uh, I spit a flow? Yeah. Come through and smash a fleet like a master chief, and you're the last elite. Woo! Dumbfounded in the passenger seat and open mic in the back of the Jeep. What they know about it? And we got the master key. And like Lil Romeo, Master P, you about to smash the street. Twist my mustache like Dick Dastardly. MCs can't get past the speeds that we rockin'. MCs are so chocolate, trying to match up against this apocalypse, but I'm deleting it. MCs, I'm hotter than your fingertips after touching ovens. This is more of what you're loving. Give you an uppercut, then make you touch then, your cousin. Then you catch an yeah. uppercut again. I'd be like, Yo, you already fucked you, and now I'm gonna freak a friend. Ugh. Oh, that's three times. Three broads like Bill Paxton, on one like Phil Jackson. I sit on the bench and coach, these cats are slipping. No, never that, I sever tracks, it's prolific. So, big shots to Quest, cats already know. Swim team, shout out, fish. Shout outs to G4, you could type in YouTube on your keyboard. Hunched over like Igor, you need to take a detour. Your ass got a weak score, maybe a high score. I got three blow spots like C4, cause they're donkey or ass like Eeyore. Thirsty I need fish. like three bars more. We're so hardcore. <laughs> so hardcore. Smash your hand on the car door. And yes. go go to those conventions for Star Wars. Yeah. Picking up bar whores. <laughs> Spinning on them like old cardboard. Let's go. Hit them with a dart board. I don't know. I'm thirsty thirsty fish. fish. 8-Bit Bandit. Super Barrio Brothers Project Blow. Thirsty yes, Fish. Yes, Testing thirsty the waters. Fish. Coming soon. Swim team. Come on. Swim team all day. Just growing up in L.A. in general, everybody freestyles, you know, even if you're whack or dope or whatever. I mean, people freestyle. You know? We all essentially met up at the Project Blow, 4343 Lamar Park, out here in L.A. It kind of evolved into, like, what it is now. You know how, like, in Greece, they would, like, uh, throw people in the Colosseum with wild animals and, like, you'd have to, like, fight for your survival. You'd have to, like, come back with the skull of the animal. It's kind of one of those kinds of things. Everybody is really dope and really aggressive. Right. So as soon as you step foot... On that corner, people are coming at your head, and you you have to get your skills up just to defend yourself. You know what I mean? And then we all come out of the blow academy like little monsters. You know, it's, it attracts talent in that corner a lot. You know, from generation to generation, there's been just amazing cats. You know, so even the same growing up in Chicago, there were like two divisions of, of hip hop. You had the mainstream people who you know didn't really freestyle, and you had the people who were into the underground stuff. And we freestyled, but you know, the people in the mainstream were doing kind of what people in New York were doing. So 
if they had a dope rap they wrote, they would get in a cypher and kick that and not think nothing of it, you know, but we're coming from a more disciplined kind of thing where it's all about the skill, just like, you know, tagging or breaking is all about the skill, so, you know, like, so that was something you had to do to rap. Freestyling is still active in LA, I, you know, when we're out there, cats freestyle all the time, and, uh, Definitely, you know, it never was like a mainstream thing, honestly. So it, it's not really to me. It's it's still around. So it's important in a lot of ways. In that, like, I've been to shows, seen people have like technical difficulties and not know what to do because they don't know how to freestyle, which means they don't know how to adapt. Really? They don't know how to just go with the flow of the situation. If their beat skips, they're they're dead in the water. They can't adapt to where they're supposed to be on the beat. They forget their verse. They've just forgot their verse. They're they're 50 cent walking around stage for like, you know yeah. what I mean? Like they don't know what to do. I mean, freestyling is like a you know survival tactic yeah. in real life too. You know what I mean?